AX20 and AX25 RT units use a filtrate return line connected to the recirculating pump in the treatment unit to send some of the nitrified effluent back to the septic tank where an anaerobic or an oxic zone exists. It is in this zone where nitrate is converted to nitrogen gas by heterotrophic facultative anaerobic bacteria. Once converted to nitrogen gas, the nitrogen escapes back into our atmosphere, completing the nitrogen cycle. The placement and amount of return flow is critical to controlling this process. Too much return flow and too much oxygen can be added, whereby reducing the chances an anaerobic environment will be maintained in the septic tank. As return flow increases, so do the chances the additional water volume will reduce the septic tank's ability to settle solids. At about 20%, of Advantex media dosing flow, or about 2.5 gallons per minute, the possibility of nitrification occurring is maximized. Furthermore, if the return flow is not directed into the septic tank sanitary T, disruption of the scum layer can occur. Once broken up by the return flow, the scum layer material is free to exit the system, potentially causing issues in treatment and drain field systems. I hope this video gives you some guidance to properly install and re the return flow piping and set the return flow volume to provide the right conditions for denitrification to occur. Please find our website at www.rcworst.com and subscribe to our channel. Thanks for watching.